Hello and welcome to our latest video from Save Me Money UK. Following on from our review of the McCulloch Rob S600, in this short video we're going to show you how you can easily complete maintenance tasks for your robotic lawnmower, including cleaning, changing the blades and fixing brakes in your boundary or guide wires. Make sure you stick around till the end of this video when I'll be giving you an extra tip for how you can keep your robotic mower looking pristine. So let's check it out. It is important to keep your robotic lawn mower clean. Grass, leaves and mud stuck to your machine will impact its ability to cut your lawn efficiently and it may struggle up slopes it should easily be able to climb. Before you clean your product, make sure you've turned it off for added safety. This can be done by pressing the on off button for 3 seconds. It is recommended you regularly clean your robotic lawnmower using a soft bristle brush to remove any dirt from the wheels, chassis and blade disc. At the same time, check the blade disc rotates freely in relation to the foot guard. You can use water via a brush or hose to clean your robotic lawnmower. Never use a high pressure washer or solvents on your device. If particularly dirty, you can use a soap solution or washing up liquid. It is important you change your blades every 6 to 12 months. The lifetime of the blades can vary with factors including operating time and size of the working area. The presence of objects such as pine cones, large sticks, stones or roots can damage the blades or the machine itself and should therefore be removed from the lawn. It is important that your mower blades are sharp as they cut more easily and create less drag reducing energy usage and preserve the life of your battery. Sharper blades also leave a cleaner cut and can help prevent fungal diseases from attacking your lawn. You can replace a full set of blades for as little as £1. To replace the blades, turn off your product by again pressing the on off button for 3 seconds. Turn your robotic lawnmower upside down and place the body on a soft and clean surface to avoid scratching the body and the keypad cover. Remove the three screws and blades using a straight or cross tip screwdriver. Take this opportunity to clean the area under the screw and blade which can often collect debris from your lawn. Fasten the new blades and screws. It is recommended that you replace all three blades, i.e. a full set, even if the blades are intact for best mowing results. Your blades should come with new screws and these should be replaced together to maintain a balanced cutting system and prevent screw wearing during mowing, which may result in a blade being propelled from under the mower causing serious injury. Once all new blades and screws are securely fastened, check that the blades can pivot freely. Should you need to repair any breaks in the boundary or guide wire, these can be easily and quickly fixed using a coupler. Put both ends into the coupler, ensuring you can see the end of both of the wires through the transparent area of the coupler, and that both wires are fully inserted. Once you are happy both wire ends are correctly in place, push the button on the coupler with a pair of pliers firmly. It is correct when the button is fully depressed. Please note it is not sufficient to twist the cable together or screw into a terminal block. Soil moisture will cause the wire to oxidise and after time will result in a broken circuit. The couplers are waterproof and the special gel inside them keep your cables from moisture and ensures a solid connection. One thing I've recently discovered which will help keep your robotic lawnmower looking pristine is Turtle Wax Hybrid Sealant Hydrophobic Wax Spray. I now use this regularly on my car and also on my robotic lawnmower. It is the ultimate method for long lasting durability and super hydrophobic water beading effect on your robotic lawnmower surface. This easy to use product sprays on and wipes off with very little effort while delivering a superior shine and protection that will last from anywhere from 6 to 12 months. When used as part of your regular maintenance schedule, it will keep your robotic lawnmower's exterior looking new and cleaner for longer. The super hydrophobic barrier helps to prevent dusty soils from redepositing on exterior surfaces. It can be applied to wet or dry bodywork for easy and quick application. I've popped links to some of the items mentioned in this video in the description box below should you wish to check them out. Many of them are also compatible with other manufacturers but I recommend that you check the product listing before purchase. So there we have it, a guide to some of the most common maintenance tasks you'll need to perform on your robotic lawnmower to keep it working in perfect order. If you've not already done so, check out our product review of the feature packed McCulloch Rob S600. If you found this video useful, please do like it and subscribe to our channel to keep up with new content we'll be uploading. Thanks for watching, see you next time.